in the last video you were introduced to an exact differential equation let us now try to solve an exact differential equation consider this function this is the general form of an exact differential equation recall that m is equal to the partial differentiation of r with respect to x and n is equal to partial differentiation of r with respect to y in order to solve an exact differential equation just follow these steps integrate m differentiate the result obtained in step 1 with respect to y equate the result obtained in step 2 with n integrate the result obtained in step 3 combine the results obtained in step 1 and step 4 now let us try to solve an exact equation using a numerical example consider this numerical example comparing the given equation with the general form of an exact equation we have y plus 2x is equal to m and x plus 3y square is equal to n partial derivative of m with respect to y and partial derivative of n with respect to x gives the same result that is equal to 1 therefore del m by del y is equal to del n by del x and the given equation is an exact equation in order to solve this exact equation we follow the steps discussed earlier recall that m is a partial derivative of r with respect to x integrating m gives this result So, phi of y is a constant in this integration process. It is actually not a constant. Do you know why? Think it over. equate the result obtained in step 2 with n gives this result integrating phi dash y gives this result combine the results obtained in step 1 and step 4 these are the results obtained from step 1 and step 4 and combining the two results gives r of xy is equal to xy plus x square plus y cube 